Good evening, folks. This is Darth Ravager 07 coming to you tonight with another core class review. I have none other than this most excellent Legacy Core Class Hot Rod. It's got some nice art at the top of the box. There's a look at the side of the box. And on the back, we get her done in eight steps. It comes with the little combinable weapon. Uh, it's a sword. And the side of the box art. You have Optimus, you have Hot Rod, you have RC Blaster, Bulkhead, and one part of Earth. If I had some Decepticon core class, what should I do? I can take the box arts, and then you get both sides of the story there. On the flip adverse side, you got Megatron, you got Drag Strip, Iguanas, Skywarp, and Kickback. And then, I guess that's Cybertron, and... It's a little warping through with the legacy and the legacy is in the portal there. Anyway, that's just kind of neat that it does that. I'm not sure. Yeah. yeah box art is box art. That's pretty cool. Anyway, let's get that, that out of the way. It comes with this nice purpley reminds me of Shatter Glass instructions. But there's what that looks like inside of the instructions. And I like the little <laughs> It'll do right here to show it's in its mode there. And then the sword can be done in this and that way and the other. And there's the combination of the three pieces. Hot rug is that piece, iguanas is that middle piece, and then the hilt is the sky warp. So let's get this guy on the table and start looking at him. Thanks again for watching. Of special note, if you wanted to go ahead and pause here, you can scan that and see a nice little uh tech specs kind of bio online so you get your qr codes ready to go pause it and scan that bad boy and here is core class hot rod on the turntable we're going to get this sucker going around in the circles here and we're going to use said combined weapon we can actually look at that right here we have the combined weapon there's the hot rod piece combined in with the iguanas piece and the hilt and it can accommodate folks with the uh, three meter or the five meter pegs and so there's that so anyway going back over here to hot rod he's got a place up there on his spoiler that he can have that stick out I don't like the hubcaps that kind of annoys me to no end of the earth then we got the visible feet syndrome in the back end of the car mode and uh, the windows are nicely painted the other paint paps are nicely applied I uh, might get a hold of the repo label and split it so I can put it right there in the middle and make that, you know, like hot rod. I'm really underwhelmed with these offerings, the core class. Got a hold of a couple of the new edge stuff, and I know it's not even, it's apples to oranges kind of comparison, but uh, the oranges are just so much sweeter when it's the new edge stuff because not only they got the details, they got the other stuff going on and uh wow so that's what i'm about to do it for the car mode let's get this guy transformed in three two one and and here's core class hot rod in his core class robot mode and he's got uh basically articulation wise he's got right here is hindered by the shoulder fin or the dorsal car spoiler fin, sorry. Uh, there's that, it's got some wiggle. A ball joint there at the elbow, no wrist, uh, no waist due to transformation. And he can kick up his leg that far and kick his leg back this far. And he's got a little under 90 right there at the knee. No ankle rockers. Like I said, this is Core Class Hasbro edition. And they do not have all the articulation the New Age stuff has. Let's get this guy going around on this thing. And Hot Rod right here has some articulation in the shoulders there. He's got some elbow going on. His head will swivel. He's got just a little bit. No, it's side to side only. No up and down at all. No way swivel. Knees, legs kick that far. Go back that far. And he's got less than 90 there. No ankle rockers. This is just Hasbro Core Class for you. 
even though it's nicely painted and the eyes and everything look great i can't really highly recommend this as those hub caps are absolutely ugly this is kind of nasty back here on the back and you got stowage and whatnot i just i'm going to move right into my final thoughts right here one moment and some final thoughts like i said uh this guy snapped right here with this uh it does like a combiner wars kind of move along with this folding up like top and front of the car onto the back of the legs snapped and it's definitely not got the the new age uh articulation i can't even recommend this for the kiddos or whatever but if you got the core class figures inside of the hasbro line i guess you'll finish this little wee feller here he does come with three the weapon's actually cooler than this figure because it combines with the other three pieces and i kind of just spoiled that all together but i think it looks the best that way if you want to pose it things you can do options they're all good um if you get this guy just be careful because like that is broken i'll try to you know glue it back together and see what it'll do if it'll stay i doubt it once it's broken it's a tiny piece it's usually broke for good all that said and done if if you're a completionist get these and, and you got the other core class figures go for it this little weapons kind of need to have but uh i can't recommend this guy thanks again for watching my channel uh please smash that like button subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already and if you're in a position to help the channel grow uh please consider donating to my patreon thanks again to all those who watch y'all have an excellent safe week till all are one